It's supposed to be a moment What good is being the one When you the only one that knows it What's good, bitch ass niggas? How y'all motherfuckers feeling? It's the GOAT God in this bitch! ISO God Sensei. IQ God, you know. <laughs> that young nigga swan, man. So look, I got y'all a nice video today. If you new, subscribe. Um, I hope you Christmas noobs see this. So all y'all um players that been playing, y'all y'all be sure to link them, you know. Link a Christmas noob, you know, share this video. I'ma I'm gonna help y'all out, man. I'ma let y'all know. The best builds in in all of in 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 all of 2K, okay? When it, when it comes all the way from the one to the five, you know, park, pro am, all that shit, man. So even you other dudes have been. I, I'ma let y'all know my opinion, and um, it's a fact. But um, yeah, man. So first, I'm gonna let y'all know ball handlers okay the best builds to make ball handlers. Let, let, let me let me give y'all a little example okay a lot of people like to say you know make make what you want stop copying other people but but look li listen here if i play a if i play a um say say, say i made um a shot creating playmaker you know my main build right now say i made a shot creating playmaker and i made him five nine Versus my 6'7 shot creating playmaker. And say my 6'7 shot creating playmaker, say that version of me didn't play for a week, and that 5'9 version of me played every day. You don't know who would win? The 6'7 version of me. You're only as good as your build will let you be, my nigga. According to your play style. So look, we gonna dive right into it, my nigga. So, number one, I think this is the best build in the game. A shot maker. That is shot creating first, playmaking second and you have to make him 6'7". 6'7 is the highest height you can be and still speed boost. You will be able to speed boost at 88 overall. The build you want to make him, lowest weight, you want any, okay, this goes around the board. Any ball handler you make, you want their shoulder width to be the smallest. It makes you dribble better. You always want to max out your wingspan on every player, okay? Simple. Okay, you feel me? Here goes another build. Okay, six seven play sharp. That is playmaking first, sharp second. You, I think you'll be able to beat speed boost at like eighty seven. I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comment section down below. Um, a lot of people have the six five and all. And look, if you have the six five versions of these builds and you're not like a super competitive geek, keep him. It's not worth it to make another build, bro. Okay? This game is fucking trash. Don't let 2K rob you. This is for the Christmas news, my nigga. Or if you just looking to make a new build. Now, third. Pure playmakers. Yes, they are gods. Okay? They're very glitchy. The two best builds is the shot maker and the pure point forward. What you're going to do, my nigga, you're going to make him 6'10". Okay? lowest weight okay and you know the same directions i said in the beginning you feel me trust me you'll be able to shoot and all that you know if you get good or whatever those are the three ball handling builds anything else you make is trash i see a lot of you bum ass niggas <laughs> y'all niggas is putting um uh, these uh lockdown plates shut up let, let me give you some advice man these niggas that pull these 10 hour to 12 hour shifts, you not gonna find something that they don't already know. People, they bounce all these ideas off each other, a lot of them test them, and they see, okay? They see what's ass. So, you're not going to be able to find, like, a lot of y'all old heads are just idiots. Y'all y'all think y'all know everything, my nigga. You go and make a build, it end up trash. I mean... Niggas that play the game every day, you, you're not going to find something they don't know, okay? This is in the meta, the best builds all around, park and pro am, okay? And your builds will be versatile. Now, here, go, here goes another ball handling build, but, you know, you could kill niggas in the park, but the pure shot creator. But in the pro am, he going to be worthless, my nigga, unless the nigga's taller. You got these baby shot creators, you're going to get fucking destroyed. You can get off with that shit in the park, cause niggas is ass. But you could do the exact same thing with the um, shot maker, that six seven big boy, as you could do with a pure shot creator. If, if we be in a hundred, 
and you can you know, you're way fast shot maker way better okay period now now i'm gonna talk to y'all about lockdowns okay this is how you make your lockdowns six seven or six ten and you don't go pure lockdown in this game you need to be able to shoot threes or you are limiting yourself extremely okay you can't shoot threes you're limiting yourself you're limiting your team you're making it harder you might get by but you could get by easier you feel me so what you're going to do is you're going to put lockdown first sharp second you feel me no other option my nigga lockdown first sharp second okay simple if you put sharp first and then lock down or playmaking first and then lock down or uh whatever else niggas be doing it's worthless stop you're not playing no d i've played with like four um sharp then lockdown fucking garbage getting destroyed no defense okay you want to make a lockdown make them and i see six five lockdown sharps they seem to not be able to to guard the 610 point forward and they're like really babies so make them six seven and on non ball handling archetypes you want to max out your shoulder width, okay period so six seven six ten i think the six ten eventually people are going to find out that's going to be the only way to stop these six ten point forwards or six seven shot maker like a little more i, I don't know I'm not sure, but I'm thinking that might be the only way because I, I see some pretty glitchy shit from these 6'10 pure point forwards, my nigga. But, um, yeah. So, now we are going to talk about sharps, okay? Um, shot creating, then sharp. I see some niggas use that build. You could kill with that. Or sharp, then shot creating. I don't know. Blah, blah, blah. I'm not too familiar with those builds, but I see some people have it. But look, listen. Unless you're a cheesy, pure sharp, okay? Like, you can run the one, okay? There is no point to have him like 6'5 or whatever. You might as well as make him 6'10. The benefit is you can run Pro-Am with him, okay? And not have to be the two spot. You could be the three, you know, or you can have a bigger lineup. You'll be able to get boards. You'll be able to play a little better defense. Y'all, y'all, a lot of y'all... Y'all want some extra speed just because it feels better. But your your production is still going to be the same either way. But you'll just be able to help out your team that much more. And you'll be able to shoot over niggas and all that shit. 610 pure sharp is the best pure sharp build. And then you got the uh the stretch big. I mean, I guess that's good for a uh, four spot or you know, park especially. Okay. It's a, it's a good build, but you can get dominated down low. But if you're not a fucking idiot, you know, you know, wait, wait, wait we'll, we'll talk about the centers later on. Okay. So if you make a pure sharp, make that nigga 610. Okay. Just trust me. And if you don't have that already, I mean, don't go make a new one unless you competitive, blah, blah, blah. Okay. So the best slashing archetypes, keep in mind, you have to be able to shoot threes, bro. Don't try and do something. No, I see a lot of y'all, y'all got these builds. It's trash, my nigga. You feel me? And um, for there's another ball handling arc. It's like um, shot slash or something like that. Um, don't use that because you can't speed boost to like 98. I don't even know what builds those are, but um, or it's the other way around. One of them you can't speed boost to mad long, and it's it's kind of a waste, my nigga. But I don't know. Here are the best slashers, man. You got the 610 slashing sharp. And you got the 611 slashing sharp. Okay. Um, you're gonna want to max your weight, okay? And um, you know, do do all that other shit, okay? Yeah. Here are the best centers, okay? In the game. Now, first I'm gonna tell y'all the builds that can shoot threes, then I'm gonna tell y'all the dominant, you know, screen and all that in this is ver th these can work in pro am and the park okay lock down first three point second go ahead max your weight all that little bullshit you feel me and yeah you feel me y'all 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 get the trends on how i'm telling y'all these builds 
Lockdown three point, okay? That's a very good build. A lot of top players use it, blah, blah, blah. And make them 7 3, okay? Max weight, all that shit. That, that's for all these builds. Athletic. Athletic first, then three point, 7 3. A nice little build, you know. <laughs> Rebounding. Rebounding first, and three point second, 7 3. You know, same shit, blah, blah, blah. Now, here are the builds, and go ahead and make these 7 3. Max weight, all that bullshit too, my nigga. Pure athletic, super cheesy, super cancer. Dunk on niggas every play, pin niggas every play. Super cheesy, okay? Athletic glass, very good build. Same same way, okay? Um, glass athletic. Glass then athletic, which is rebounding then athletic. And um, yeah, yeah, man. Those are the best builds in the game. And, you know, stretch bigs, you know, you fit them where you fit them. This is basically, a lot of y'all always ask me about builds, comment about builds. Now you have my opinion, my nigga. I hope this wasn't too all over the place. Um, y'all let me know y'all's favorite builds, what builds you're making, if you're still building players, or if you just hate this goddamn game. Y'all reach out to me in the damn comment section below, and y'all let me know what else y'all want um, tutorials on. Be sure to subscribe if you're new. And I'll follow your boy on Twitch. And I'm out this